What's up guys, it's the only ninja wearing aviators in a superhero hat bringing you another video here on the Modern Ninja channel this Saturday and we're going to be going over a new comma combination this time basing it off of built and building it off of the last trick we did which was this one so if you haven't seen that video uh, definitely hit the link in the description and check out the, the playlist I did it like not that long ago so definitely check that out first because you need to be able to do this in order to do this combo but without further ado let's get into this video I know I said without further ado before but I just want to point out my new hat guys check this out it says the modern ninja hold up we got it says the modern ninja it has my numbers 10 232 has some of my favorite weapons on the side the size and it says <laughs> even and I'm out <laughs> on this hat I love this hat my mom actually got this hat for my birthday so I am pretty sure my mom actually watches these videos so thank you very much but let's get back to what we were doing so we're gonna be doing a combination with our commas today it's gonna be a basic hyper or XMA style combination if you don't know what XMA is definitely check the link the video I did a little bit ago links in the description but this is for you guys who want to learn that stuff. So let's get to it. First thing you need to know is that a chop will be a horizontal comma strike and a punch will be a vertical comma strike. So if I refer to it as a chop, it's going to be horizontal. If I refer to it as a punch, it's going to be vertical. Just so we're all working with the same with the same information. So first, you're going to step out with your right leg into a front stance facing this way, chopping in the opposite direction, just like this, keeping this other hand tight chambers right tight by those ribs so you want bang just like that and that's a nice cross in the beginning bang just like that then you're gonna go over to your punch wang just like that so and again when you punch look at my stance it switches directions when I do that punch so it's gonna be one two then the same thing on the other side three four just like that for your chops you're facing away Punches facing towards, chops facing away, punches facing towards. Then what we're gonna do is we're gonna chop across, coming through again, horizontal, because it's a chop, chopping across to a double punch to the side. Chop, punch, chop, punch, spin through, double punch. From here, you're gonna do that finger spin that we were working the last video, so that's why I said you need to do this. The last video, finger spin, thumb spin, and finish. Guys, I hope you like this video. I really like this spot for recording. I don't know if you can tell, but I've been out here a lot. Uh, I'm actually doing a bunch of these videos all the same day, I'm not gonna lie. But um, I hope you guys enjoy these videos. If you want to learn any more things about commas, definitely let me know down in the description so I can do more episodes about commas. Again, if you want to get yourself a pair of these, definitely check out 10th Degree Weapons. They give awesome commas with different colors and you can get magneto ones like these ones or you can get regular ones it doesn't matter to me but it will matter to you so you have those options so with all that said please don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to see the next videos that come out on this channel but till then my name is dj moore this is the modern ninja and i'm out <laughs>